The stories from the beginning of the pandemic will stay with us forever. The shortage of hospital beds, the shortage of PPE for doctors and nurses, the frontline workers who didn't see their families for months at a time so as not to risk infection. The days were always very chaotic. We, we always would say like we were putting out fires. You would put out one fire, you would get a patient stabilized, and then your next patient would crash, and then it would be vice versa. And I felt all day we were just putting out fires over and over again. But the long, grueling, and emotionally charged shifts seem to have served as inspiration more than anything else. The application rate for Holy Names Nursing School has jumped by 90% in comparison to last year. I was shocked when I saw the number of applicants rising, and mainly because you know, people saw the, the other side of COVID. They saw how difficult it was, how long the shifts were, the amount of PPE that needed to be used, all of the equipment that's used. You know, there's, there's a significant amount of technology that a nurse needs to be able to accomplish when she's caring for a patient. And initially you would think that might scare people away. But I really believe that people saw that and realized, you know, I'm up for the challenge and, and I'm willing to learn if you're willing to teach me. It seems that now, perhaps for the first time, nurses are in the spotlight, getting the praise and acknowledgement they so clearly deserve. I think there's been such a spotlight on nurses and I feel some people didn't always understand what a nurse exactly does. Um, if you've never had a family member, if you've never been in the hospital, it's it's a little hard to understand. They kind of maybe see us as like a doctor's helper, which really isn't the case. We're very like independent and autonomous. Um, so I think people really realize from the news outlets w how big of an impact nurses have on a day to day basis for patients. Nursing schools across the state, such as Rutgers School of Nursing, have all reported an uptick in the number of applicants. At St. Peter's University, they're seeing triple the number of accelerated applicants. I think it's great that people in times of great stress want to go into a career like this. It's like similar, you know, people, you know, they saw 9-11 and they wanted to become firefighters or cops. It's such a noble thing that in such a terrible, terrible time and you could see how bad things can be that you want to do that type of thing. Or perhaps it's more simple than that. I think nursing is a calling and I think people are just starting to realize that calling. In Teaneck, Emily Young. New Jersey News Network.